I think people need nowadays the bed and breakfast experience as a whole to step back away from the routine and the fast pace that they're living in. A place in time is a traditional B&B. One of the best parts of our place is the uh, 1914 historical landmark in Fredericksburg. The front porch is special, the wraparound porch and uh, nice comfortable chairs. People are amazed when they sit there and they truly do go back in time to when things were simpler and we used to just rock on the porch and visit. And that's one of the things when couples come, a lot of times they'll ask me to take pictures of them and their families on the front porch uh, before they leave. We enjoy a big hearty gourmet breakfast every morning. When we bought the house, one of the cutest things that we found was the upstairs room called the Ruby Bell Suite. And what's really nice about it is you can tell that probably in the 40s, someone went upstairs and did some remodeling. And they built a bathroom and they made two separate bedrooms. So that the unique thing about that room is that when you rent the Ruby Bell Suite, you get the whole upstairs. You get an outdoor porch uh, that's screened in. You get a uh, table with four chairs to sit and play cards or just visit. And what ends up happening is we end up having a lot of girls weekends or adult couples that come in and spend the night upstairs. So that's a real nice place. And the blue room is unique in that it has a huge king size bed and you've got a monstrous bathroom there with two big sinks and a bathroom. The garden room, which is in the back of the property, is newer. So it has a, a beautiful view of the back of the property where we have unique sculptures, uh, seating areas. We even have a fire pit that people can use if they choose. Just a really nice place. It's quieter back there, uh, a newer feel, and just a lot of, a lot of privacy back there. One of the nice features of our property is that we've got private baths for all the rooms. And in those baths, you have showers, and in one of the rooms, a full bathtub. All the rooms have coffee makers. My wife has her PhD in health promotion and is a nutrition uh, major, master's degree in nutrition. So special diets don't upset us at this B&B. We can handle that for people. Some people come to visit us for privacy and a romantic interlude where they don't want to see a lot of people except those that they've come here with. Others uh, want to socialize and they want to learn more about everything there is to know about Fredericksburg and everyone else is staying at the bed and breakfast. So we try and accommodate both needs and we do that when we greet you at the door and we learn a little bit more about what you've come to Fredericksburg for and if it's privacy, we quietly disappear into the background and we'll see you at breakfast. Uh, if you want to socialize, we'll help, we'll help with that area as well and get you to the places where, where the people are. When people leave here, they're a little bit upset that they have to get back into that fast pace again. Because here they've been able to relax, sit, have some tea, some good food, listen to music, shop, just be leisurely in Fredericksburg. And, and that's what they think about when they leave. And they also say, you know, we'll be back.